I'm Cindy Traciola, real estate agent, and today we're in Parker, Colorado. I'm gonna show you a Taylor Morrison home. We are at the Reserve at Looking Glass community, and this home is the Roxboro. Let's go take a look. This home has 2,862 finished square feet with approximately 1,400 in the basement being optional. This home does have a finished basement, so I will show you that here shortly. The base starting price is $724,990. Of course, this one has a bunch of upgrades, so let's get started taking a look. When you first walk in, there's this little entryway where you can put some decorative items like they have. If we come in through here, there's the door to go to the basement, which we'll do a bit shortly. And then you come in a little bit more through this little hallway, and now we're in a bedroom. As you can see, this is quite a decent sized bedroom and we've got some natural lighting. We have one window that faces the side of the home slash front. We've got recessed lighting and there's just quite a lot of room in here. And then if we come out here, we've got a full bathroom right here, but also I'll mention we've got a linen closet right here. And then this bathroom with a walk-in shower. And we've got quartz countertops, some really great cabinetry. I love the colors that Taylor Morrison is using. Now when you come out of the bathroom, we can come into the home a lot more. So here's our staircase going upstairs, which we'll do that here in a few. But then we've also got our coat closet right here. And then we walk into this great room. And as you can see, it is quite large. We've got a gorgeous fireplace here. I love the mantle. They're using some really different materials, so you're not gonna see the same thing that everybody's using. The room is quite large. We've got a lot of windows all around, so a ton of natural lighting, a great chandelier. I like how they're using the wide plank flooring, also the engineered flooring, which is always nice. And then here we've got sliders to take us out to the patio. Now this is a walkout lot, so we've got this Trex deck right here, and it's covered with recessed lighting, and then the yards in this area are really quite large. You can really get some good lots here. This lot is just huge, and we've got some great views and a lot of trails around, so it's just a great area. Now, if we come back in here, let's go take a look at the kitchen. So the kitchen, as you can see, we've got a quartz countertop with some room for seating. They've got four chairs pulled up comfortably. All stainless steel appliances. Here we've got our oven, we've got our microwave. We have a lot of cabinetry and we've got a five burner gas stove in our hood and then our dishwasher right here. So really nice if you wanna cook and watch TV. I mean, it's just a perfect setup. And then here, if we go over here, we have our dining room. So quite a lot of room here as well with a lot of natural light. And then if we go this direction, this is an office. So we've got our French doors here. So if we wanna shut the doors and have some privacy, kind of block out the noise, this is a great office. We've got one window here facing the back of the home very high ceilings with a lot of lighting. So this is a great office and it's really conveniently located close to the kitchen for getting the coffee or tea. Then here we've got the walk-in pantry. Now when we come out of the pantry, this is the little mudroom area. So here's the door to the garage and you could make this into a little mudroom, add a little bench, you know, whatever you wanna do, of course. And then here we have a coat closet. So great little area here. 
Now let's go back out and we're gonna head upstairs. One of the first things I wanna show you when you get upstairs is how open this home is. It just has such an inviting feel. When you get to the top of the staircase, you can go multiple directions as you can see. We're gonna go directly to the right and we're gonna look at a junior suite. So when you turn right, when you first come in this door, here is the bathroom. So we've got a walk-in shower, and then of course our quartz countertops and cabinetry, a lovely bathroom. And then here we have a linen closet, which is super handy. And then if you come in a little bit more, you will be in the bedroom. This is just a great bedroom. There's a lot of room, it's very spacious. And then we also have a walk-in closet. So not just the linen closet, but a walk-in closet. So that's really handy. Now, if we come out of here, we'll go back into the hallway and we'll go this direction. Here we have a linen closet right here. And then we've got a couple bedrooms. So let's go directly to the right and look at this one. And as you can see, this one is super bright because we've got a lot of natural lighting with our big picture windows. We've got high ceilings and recessed lighting as well. So a very spacious bedroom that connects to a bathroom. So here we've got our separate counters and sinks, cabinetry, and then a walk-in closet right here. And then really what I love about this is that here would be a door right here, and then it separates the loo and the shower bath area. So really nice for privacy. And then you can have another door right here, and now we're going into the other person's bathroom, technically, right? With our separate counter space cabinetry, and again, another walk-in closet. And then now, we're in the other bedroom. So I love how that connects. Really, really cool, but yet there's doors so that people can have their privacy. It's just great. And again, a lot of room in this room. Now let's go out a little bit more and we're gonna go this direction and here we have the laundry room. So no lugging the clothes up and down the stairs. Laundry room right here. And we have a utility sink with some great cabinetry and counter space, really convenient. And then here we have our second level furnace AC. And then if we keep going, as you can see, it's just open this whole way, which is great. Now we're in the primary suite. What a great room. Look at the views from this room. Really gorgeous. Tons of natural lighting, of course, with those huge windows. A lot of recessed lighting as well and there is a lot of room in here too. We've got some really large furniture. You could even add a little chair over there. We've got a little chair right here, bench right here, and there's still a lot of room to walk around. And then we go this direction to go to the primary bathroom. So we've got our soak-in tub here, and I really like how we've got a window in here so that we can have the natural lighting. And then we've got our separate counter space, which I always love. And we've got the loo over here. And then here we have the walk-in shower with a little bench and some great tile. And then also what I really like is having separate closets. So we've got separate walk-in closets. So here's one. And then if we come over here, here's the other one. 
and hopefully you can tell, but they're pretty spacious closets. That's it for the upstairs, so let's head down to the basement. When you first get downstairs, the way that they have laid this basement out, they've laid it out to where you have multiple directions of where you can go. We're gonna go to the right. We've got storage right here. And here we've got a closet with some shelving. So if you wanna put some games or linens or whatever you want, whatever storage. And then if you come through here, now we're in a bedroom right here. And as you can see, this type of a lot provides a window that lets a lot of natural light in, which is great. And this is a lovely bedroom. And then it also has a walk-in closet. And if we come out of this bedroom and go this direction, we will see to right here to my right or to your left is a bathroom with a shower, tub. They've used some great tile. It's just a beautiful bathroom. We've got our quartz countertops and great cabinetry, just really pretty. And then if we come out of there, now we're in the big open game room or theater room. We've got a theater section over here. So you can really divide it up nicely. It's not a huge basement, but they've really made it work. So plenty of room for the foosball table. We've got over here another door to storage, so even more room. And then we've got a table over here. So hopefully you can see on the video that they have really made a lot of use out of this space down here. And then we've also got another sliding glass door here to take us to a patio. So super cool, you don't have to go all the way upstairs to get outside. And then if you come back in, we'll go back upstairs. That's it for the tour. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see this home in person, please contact me. I'd be happy to help you out. Thank you for coming along and I will see you all on the next video. Take care, bye-bye.